That's it. That's it, guys. I'm going to give everybody a second to get in here before I get going. I'm going to say hi to everybody before we get going. This is going to be one of those shows, fellas, where it's, uh, there's going to be a lot of emotions. Anybody that knows Titan Anderson knows that uh, my first ever video, my first ever video was a live draft reaction when we drafted Derrick Henry. It wasn't in Austin Johnson. It was... It wasn't, uh, it wasn't anybody else. It was, uh, for some reason, something told me when I was hanging out with my brothers and some friends, take out your phone and hit record. I hit record and um, a lot of people, a lot of people thought it was funny, my reaction. So then from there, I started making more videos and more videos. I started seeing the capabilities. I started seeing the fun. I started seeing hey, man, I think maybe I have a lane here, right? Like, I get to call the games. I get to, I had a vision that I wanted to do and and we had the right guy. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's crazy how that's where it started and and to where it's come today. I mean, I mean, our last live stream, fucking crazy, man. This live stream is probably going to be way crazier because of what, what it's about. Um, so, but one thing I want to let everybody know, and I'm going to let Derek Henry know, thank you so fucking much. Thank you so much for this this um, this amazing run. Thank you so much for the memories, all the reactions, all the people that I've gotten to celebrate your amazing moments with, your amazing, uh, some of the things that you did. I mean, stiff arming people, throwing them around like they're a volleyball, like uh, bouncing Seahawks down uh, down the beach like a fucking uh, football, basketball, whatever. It, it's amazing some of the stuff he's done. He's, he's thrown people out of the stadium. Uh, he's thrown touchdown passes. He's run for a 99-yard touchdown. He's gone for 2,000 yards. He's the only running back to ever go, uh, go six times, 200 yards and two touchdowns. Nobody has more than three. So the best big play running back of all time. He is now a Baltimore Raven. Derrick Henry, ladies and gentlemen, is a Baltimore Raven. I need to know what you guys think in the chat section, how you guys are all feeling. I haven't, like I said, I literally, I haven't even gotten into anything. I, I literally was just getting back from work and, uh, and I, and I, I'm sorry I was late. I, again, I was at work forever today, but you know, while I was thinking, I was getting, so, I was getting so much fucking, I was getting so many fucking messages, bro. Ta, you're not saying anything on Twitter, and I, I, I put one thing out on Twitter. I don't want to say anything on Twitter. I'm waiting for this moment. I'm waiting to come here today and talk for however long I need to. But I promise you, it's probably gonna be a while. So you better get your fucking pillows out, and you know what I'm saying. You better let everybody know it's about to go. Something's about to happen. Um. I just, uh, I'm just, like I said, man, Derrick Henry is uh, the greatest Tennessee Titan to ever don the colors, best player ever in this team's history. And um, I just want him to be able to accomplish everything he wants to. Uh, that being said, I hate the Ravens. You know what I mean? I just don't like the Ravens. But um, uh, at the end of the day, he gets to go somewhere. Uh, and, and and for all those people who, who keep saying, why didn't you pay him? Why didn't you pay him? He, you paid Pollard, but... Listen, bro, it was a mute. You could easily tell he <laughs> we obviously talked. He did. He wanted to try something else like his time here was done. We're clearly in rebuild. But I'll tell you what, be careful using that word around the Titans. It looks like we're bringing in the right guys. I think we're we're we may not be as far away as, as we think. Um, But but he wanted to. He probably was like, look, just look, I want to I want to I want to I got a couple three years left, two, three years left in my prime. However many years left, he's a freak, right? Respectfully. Um, I'm going to go try it out. Let me go try something else. And I bet you we were like, you know what? You're the greatest to ever do it here. Do what you need to do. Thank you for everything. And all of us, all of you salty Titans fans, shame on you. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? Everything this man did? Nobody was even watching this team barely before he got here. Are you kidding me? Ask Taylor Lewan. He's the proof. Don't ask me. But I I'm just going to keep it a band. 
Look at the team. Before he got here, we were losing very bad. And we know it was a bad, bad period around those times. But guess what? He got here and he gave us a superstar, a foundation, an identity. The Tennessee Titans became a team that you were scared of because you knew you had to tackle that big-ass Hulk. It's like Hulk and Juggernaut's brother. It's like <laughs> you can't tackle him. And then he outruns you. He, 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 put, he stiff arms you like the ultimate running back weapon, fellas. The Baltimore Ravens, you if you guys are Ravens fan, you guys are watching. I'm, it's only six minutes. We got 50 people watching. Like, we're going to go for probably an hour and a half. So, so buckle up. Um, Raven fans, I'm going to explain something to you. You guys got an amazing player on and off the football field. And you need to feed him. Don't, don't bring him in to give him the rock 10, 15 times. Give him the ball 20, 30 times a game. It'll keep Lamar Jackson fresh. It'll, I mean, can you imagine defenses preparing for that? The, the RPOs, the the play action, I mean, he's going to help Lamar Jackson a lot, a lot. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I want to get into the comment section because I feel like I've been talking too much. I'm going to continue to say what I need to say, but I, I want to hear what you guys say as well. Got to say as well, because, like again, this doesn't work without you guys. So continue to hit that like button, subscribe, comment. Um, to be honest, we, we might already be there. We might already be uh at 13,500 subscribers because you guys are just fucking un unbelievably real just you guys have been remarkable lately literally this channel's been booming lately uh so I want to thank everybody for that um but yeah I it, it's difficult to be even happy about that we're 15 subscribers away from 13,500 so if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you guys do let's hit that before we get out of here for sure that should be a cake that should be a cakewalk um but yeah, let's get into the comments. I want to say what I want to make sure that I say hi to everybody. Make sure you guys get let me know how you guys are feeling. Um, put your comments. Uh, put King Henry and how you feeling, man. Let me know. Let me know how you feeling. How you taking? If you're a Titans fan, if you're another uh, a fan from another football team, and you're you're just hearing this, let me know how you're feeling about it. Like holy shit, he's actually on a different team. It's crazy, right? Uh, Jonathan, what's up, buddy? What's up? Horacio in the building. Titanus. Uh, um, what was, uh, was that? I think I already said Jonathan. Yes, sir. Big dog. What's up, bro? Uh, Horacio, long live the king. I know, bro. It sucks, man. I can't believe... Is this real? Fucking pinch me, bro. Oh, man. Uh, Horacio says, hopefully we can get Justin Simmons. Hey, man, it's still something to look out for right there, right? Uh, Stoner Titan says, I hope Levis goes off, too. He will. He will, you guys. Don't worry. Mamba says, who thinks Levis uh, takes that sophomore leap? Hey, the way that we're picking up guys and moving, we'll be all right. Christian says, this is such a heartbreaking loss from the King. I just wish uh, that Legends last forever. You know what? He does. He will last forever. He's not on our team, but you you think that he's never, like, he's going to be known as a Titan. He's going to be known as the greatest Titan to ever do, the, to ever do it. To ever do it. He's got the stats. He's got so many records that are just his. Uh, it's just remarkable what he was able to do in the time that he was here. And again, I think he has, again, three, two, three years easily left of, of, in his prime, maybe not. I don't know. I but but we saw something pretty damn close against Jacksonville, didn't we? <laughs> he man, he made sure he let the kitty cats, the jungle kitties, know who the hell the king is. Holy shit! And hey, can we just be thankful he didn't go to the Texans? Come on, you guys! Emoji spam happiness. Let's go. Texans got enough fucking what? What they do? Bring in the whole free agency? Come on, you guys! Save some for the rest of the NFL. My God. They're like that kid on Halloween who goes up there and steals the whole fucking bucket of candy when it says, please take one. This is getting ridiculous. Y'all need to calm the fuck down. Let the Tennessee Titans do some work, too. We got some money. Don't think T.A. don't know y'all got money. I know y'all got y'all got a lot of money, but we got the most. We got the, we're at the top, bro. Y'all are near the top, but fuck. Y'all don't have to sign everybody. You're signing half the damn league. Like, come on, bro. Oh, my God. Them Texans, bro. Shout out to y'all, man. Y'all ain't playing around. You guys are trying to fucking... Y'all are trying to climb Mount Everest, huh? Y'all are trying to go to the top. Tell you what, man. We're going to be a Tennessee Titan. Ooh, we're going to be a problem. Yes, if you don't take us serious. You better take us serious, bro. Seriously. I'm dead ass serious. All of you guys. I be listening to a lot of people spit their bullshit out there, man. A lot of Colts fans, Texans fans, and Jags fans really thinking some... Thinking that the Titans are the bottom feeders of the division. Think that. Keep that same energy. Because it may seem like that right now. Wait until we go into week one with that with that roster. You're going to look at it and be like, wait a minute. 
that that that's the Titans team we're playing. You damn right. Wait, just wait. Malik Neighbors is coming, ladies and gentlemen. Malik Neighbors will be in two tone blue very shortly. Loading, fucking loading. I love it, man. Ty J Spears will be ready too. Don't even come on, bro. Also, if anyone's feeling generous, we always offer cash at money sign Titan Anderson. Send a message and we'll put it up on the community page. Read it off to you guys. Appreciate you guys always. Mamba mentality. I'm not familiar with Ty J Spears. Is he any good? Go look up his highlights and come back and let us know. Cat Nelson says, I was upset when the Rat Birds, a.k.a. Purple Pigeons, got Steve McNair, but this hurts worse than Henry. What? Uh, but this hurts worse with Henry. Sorry. Yeah, it's pretty bad, man. Make sure you guys hit that like button as well. You guys get that like button. Continue to subscribe. Let's get over 100 people in here before the 30 minute mark. We're only 11 minutes in. That's it. Um... You know, uh, when De when uh, when Steve McNair left, he actually he went to the Ravens. He actually beat us. He actually beat us. Uh, so that was pretty that pissed me off a lot. Um, so the fact that the Ravens continue to come in here and take our fucking great players for whatever reason is weird. Um, but it's OK. We, we got a we got a whole new it's a whole new team, guys. It's a whole new era. We got a brand new car. It's, it's you know what I mean? Like. We're letting go of the 67 Sh Shelby. You know what I'm saying? But we we <laughs> we got that brand new Ferrari 2026. You know what I'm saying? That, sh that shit hasn't even been seen or used by Elon Musk yet. Like, let this offense cook. Let's get it going, bro. Uh, Kakarot says, I love you, King. Be safe. Hey, we all do. Derrick Henry, man, we love and appreciate everything you've ever done for this football team, bro. Again, all the memories, man. I need to get all my highlight reactions together and put it out as a video so everyone could just re-watch them and laugh. Um, the, just the greatest player I've ever I've ever watched at the running back position. I've seen Barry Sanders run. I've seen Emmitt Smith run. I've seen Terrell Davis run. I've seen Priest Holmes run. I've seen them all. I've seen um, some of the some of the I've, hell. I'm gonna drop a sorry ass Colt. I've seen Edrian James run. He's pretty fucking good himself. Uh, we've seen the bus run. We've seen, I mean, guys, y'all, we've seen Adrian Peterson, Chris Johnson. We've seen so many, so many good ass running backs run the football. So many LT. I mean, you can go, you can go on. I mean, the list goes on with running backs. They're all good in their own right. But I've never seen anybody do what this guy's done. Like, the, he even throws touchdowns, bro. Ravens, you need to let him, like, let him be Derrick Henry because if you brought if you're bringing him in to be anything except Derrick King, Henry uh King Purple Pigeon then you're not going to it's not going to work it's not going to work let him eat feed, feed the king king purple pigeon needs to eat do that man and and we'll see what happens bro i'm not rooting for you guys but i i'm hoping Derrick Henry has success i love it man i love it What's up, everybody in the in the building? Man, there's a shitload of people already, man. I appreciate everybody for showing up. Carson, Prolific, J Beats, everybody. Michael Lim, what up, bro? <laughs> he said who got their blue monster, man. It's crazy. Uh, end of an era. It's cra it's tough. It's tough. He said, keep the crown. Oh, man. Yeah, it's tough, man. It's tough. Only one cardio. Yo, I love what my Steelers are doing. Hey, man, keep it up. Keep it up. Everybody hit that like, comment, and continue to subscribe. We're trying to hit 13,500 today. Uh, we're, we're over here celebrating we're over, uh, the, the, the amazing career of Derrick Henry. We're over here um, talking about all the memories, uh, talking about how the, the Ravens like to take all of our legends for some reason, some of our goats. Um, I don't know what they got, man. Like Maybe they got a birria thing. I don't know what it is. but uh, or, or what is it called? Biryani or whatever? Shit, man. That's crazy. Um, but again, man, Derrick Henry, I, I don't... It, it's crazy, bro. Like, look at this shit. Like, look at this shit. And it's not coming down not coming down baby it's not coming down it's never come you know what fuck that where's the fucking who put the blue in the front you know what i'm saying Derek fucking henry Derek fucking henry the greatest fucking player you guys come on bro come on let's get an emoji spam come on can we spam Derek henry in the chat can we spam thank you henry everybody type thank you henry in caps come on do it for the king real quick let's break that down real quick come on man thank you Derek henry come on bro everything he did everything he's done he he's literally brought so many new fans to this team and has set this this team that we're getting ready to get into this new team that we're getting ready to 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 uh, dive into you know to learn about and build this is all because of him we weren't doing anything before he got there you, like it's crazy we weren't winning at all he gave us new life he gave us that hope 
He gave us that superstar that you really need to be able to have primetime games. We weren't even getting any primetime games before his ass got here. There were there were times we were getting zero. Go check if you think I'm fucking lying. Literally zero. He comes, we're getting two, three, four, three, four, like every fucking year, bro. And it's because of the king. It's because of Derrick Henry, bro. It's because of Derrick Henry. The GOAT. Thank you, Derek. Everybody, man, just spam it. Spam it, dude. Don't even worry about it. You ain't going to be blocked or nothing. Uh, Matthew says, 22 forever, King of Nashville. Ronald Willow says, thank you so much for all the wonderful Titan memories. It's crazy, bro. Burning Devil, appreciate you for being here, bro. Important stream right here. Man, I'm going to miss Henry. He was one of a kind of uh, for us Titans. He was, uh, he was the, he was just, he was him. He was him. That's the only way to put it. He was him. The greatest, the greatest Titan we could, we could, we could have ever hoped for. It's crazy. Like you don't go into that draft and and pass on him that many times. Everybody did, and and think, yeah, we're getting ready to draft our, or we're getting ready to draft our best, the best player to ever touch the, a football field. That's crazy, bro. And that's what he ended up becoming. That's what he ended up becoming. Supreme Nick says Ravens not going to use him, right? I mean, we'll see, right? If they don't, I mean, that's their fault. King Titan Gaming says, sad moment for the Titans fans. I'm hurt, but I, but it's a business. I think that at the end of the day, everybody needs to understand that. Everybody needs to understand that it's a business, bro. It's a fucking business, and it sucks, but I'm going to try to move it over here a little bit for y'all. All right, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to, we're just going to, there we go. We're going to be like this. We're going to try to give y'all a little bit of a, all right, that's cool. We're going to leave it like that um make sure you guys subscribe hit that like button continue to comment we're gonna be live again tomorrow 6 30 to 7 o'clock right around th those times it always is so um also free agencies again titans didn't do much uh which is not a problem um maybe we just wanted today to be derrick henry day i don't know you guys tell me uh jay beat says gonna gonna miss the king but it's it's time for prince ty j to take control what do you guys think in the comment section? What do you guys think Ty J Spears is going to do this year? Ty J Spears, you guys, has all the capabilities in the world to be a superstar in this league. Uh, they pay Pollard to to really be involved. Um, I'm hoping that it's at, I mean, I would love Ty J to be bell cow, obviously, but it's just, we don't really need him to. Um, we need him to be healthy, especially if we're, to try, we're going to try to involve him in playoff opportunities uh, down the line. We're going to need him around. He's just special, right? Uh, so we'll see what happens with that. Uh, but I think that uh, I think Ty J Spears can can uh, with Pollard here can can do a 60 40 thing. I think Ty J Spears needs to be in as, as much as possible. Um, it's going to be it's going to be kind of hard to take Ty J Spears out. I, I should just do just stand, sit in front of you all like this. It's kind of hard to take Ty J Spears out when he's um, when he's making plays consistently and consistently dominating. So it's kind of crazy. It's, it, it's kind of crazy to think that um, you, you'd want to not use him or use Pollard more. But. Pollard's being paid to be to play. He's being paid to play, and I'm fine with him playing. But I, but I, I again, I, I don't want it to be like to where you, you know you're just bringing in this other guy to put, be put in front of Ty J. And I don't like that. Use them both correctly. Use them both correctly. Uh, Titanus says, "Ta, what do you think about Justin Simmons maybe signing with us and trading for Snead? Maybe if the Chiefs accept our deal, I'm still hoping out for that shit. I'm still hoping out for that. I'm gonna keep. I'm, I'm just gonna be honest. I'm hoping out for that. I really am." I hope I hope that the uh, I hope that the Tennessee Titans can uh, can uh, bring in Justin Simmons. That would help right now. Uh, he's a very good safety, very good safety. Sneed's a very good corner. Um, I like everything we've done so far. Everything makes sense. So we'll see what happens, man. We'll see what happens. Um, Lady Titan, the wife in the building. I feel like my brother just died, and I don't even have a brother, but at least he isn't a cowboy. <laughs> yeah, um, I'll tell you what, bro. It. Uh, it's uh everybody listening, you guys is uh it's it's tough. It's tough. We all love Derrick Henry. We all love Derrick Henry. It is what it is, though. On to new things. We gotta have a little bit more belief in in Rand and what he's doing. Look at the guys that we've already brought in, bro. We're like, we're ready to take some next, we're ready to take that next step, bro. Let's go do it. Let's take that next step, bro. You know what I mean? Let's do it. Let's do it, you guys. Let's do it. All right, where are we at? Uh, let's see. Christian says, did you know Henry had a 2000 yard season and would have done it again if he did not get hurt? Yeah, he was on pace for it for sure. He was getting a shitload of carries. Uh, Volcano says, T.A., you heard we might trade for Legereus Sneak. That's what I'm hoping for, bro. That's what I'm hoping for. That'd be nice, bro. That'd be nice. That'd be nice. Um, 
Lady Titan says, I could not root for the Cowboys ever, even if they had Derrick Henry. Yeah, she's not a Cowboy fan for sure. I'm not either. Not either, but uh, I don't like the Ravens at all either. But um, as long as they're not in, in the AFC South, that's the main thing. If he would have went to the Texans, that would have, that would have, wow, bro. Wow, wow. I would have already lost my voice. Like, for real, that would have pissed me off. Kidding me, bro. New chapter, fellas. It's a new chapter in Tennessee, baby. New chapter, new team, new squad. New squad. All you fake-ass fans can go ahead and leave. We don't give a shit. We're going to continue to hold it down. Uh, Lone Star still. Uh, Lone Star Titan says, still can't root for the Ravens ever. Love the King, though. <laughs> a lot of people are upset about that, bro, for real. Oh, my God. Uh, Titanus says, I'll root for, for Henry to win the Super Bowl, not the Ravens. I mean, he's going to be involved. Uh I don't think the Ravens are going to get any worse. You know, they they should be, you know, a really good football team next year as well. Uh, with Henry, if they use him right, they're going to be even better. So we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Yeah, Monkey says, uh, excited for Tony. Everybody should be excited for Tony. Come on, you guys. Let's get those likes up. Keep subscribing, you guys. Let's get it. We're almost at 13,500 subscribers, man. We got this. It's crazy. Yeah, Tony Pollard's going to bring a lot, you guys. He breaks a lot of tackles. Uh, he gets a lot of yards after contact. He's great in the in the in, uh, catching the ball out of the backfield. This is going to be huge for us, fellas. We're going to have two legitimate. We're I'll put it like this: a hundred percent of the time, we're going to have a fresh back with great hands in the backfield. That's amazing, bro. Matthew says Ravens ain't going to go to the playoffs this year. I mean, I we'll see. I mean, who knows, right? Who knows, bro? I don't know. We all don't know. That's for sure. We'll see what up though. This is crazy. Y'all killing it right now. I appreciate that, man. I appreciate that, bro. He says Raven's not winning the ship. Everyone like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate y'all. We ain't even halfway done, bro. We're closing in on 23 minutes, you guys. We're at the 22-minute mark for Derrick Henry. Everybody spam Derrick Henry. We're at the 22-minute mark, you guys. Thank you, King Henry. We appreciate you so much over here, man. Literally, bro, you did, you did so much for us, man. Almost took us to the Super Bowl. Ryan Tannehill couldn't figure shit out. Ah, man, so fucking close. So close. Damn, bro. Crazy. Steven says, happy for the king. Happy he didn't go to the Texans. I think everybody needs to be happy he didn't go to the Texans. Fuck that team. What's up, Al Pierce? How you doing, buddy? Yes, sir. Here we are. Here we are, right? Here we are. Here we are. Another free agency. Derrick Henry gone. Damn, this is crazy, bro. Uh, Papa C says, if Henry does not get 1,000 yards this season, he needs to get off the Ravens. If he doesn't get a thousand yards this season, that's gonna be weird, bro. That's gonna look weird too. It's gonna be like, damn, bro, he declined fast, or what the hell is wrong, bro? Yeah, Derrick Henry's forever a Titan. Don't let don't let nobody don't let nobody fool you. Oblige says, TA, out of all the remaining free agents, who do you want? I just want guys who are gonna come in and fucking help, bro. Like literally, there's I mean, look at I'm just gonna tell you to bring in somebody. We, I just want to make sure their mentality is where it needs to be. It needs to be a guy who loves football. It needs to be a guy who who is aggressive, who will not allow you to just bully them or talk shit. Like they're gonna, I. That's why Legarius makes sense, bro. It just does. Like I really want to get that done, bro. Like that'd be the perfect pickup. That'd be the perfect pickup, fresh off of that that rookie deal. Like come on, bro. He's he's really in his prime right now. Like come on. If we were if we were just some. This defense is is beat up, bro. Justin Simmons as well. Justin Simmons would be great, man. We don't like I said, uh, Elijah Molden kind of a combination DB guy back there. Uh, Amani Hooker can't stay healthy, bro. It's like, I mean, Simmons can come in right away and take over. He, I mean, literally all the way up until we go to the new stadium easily, and uh, and I and I think he could be somebody perfectly fit for this football team, but. Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know in the, in, in the chat section below. Yes, sir. <laughs> That's crazy. Uh, Sambo says, everyone pray for Will Levis when we face the Texans D-line. We'll see what happens. Why Don't count us out. Don't think just because they, they signed half the NFL free agents that they're, that they're just going to beat us. Don't do that. Come on, bro. Jay Beats says, I'm that kid who took all the candy. Don't diss us Halloween Bowl tick takers, T.A. <laughs> Oh man, come on, bro. Are we serious right now? Uh Christian says, Hey TA, would you agree though? It sucks like you have to go through it. Like 
with Steve McNair left as well, but fuck the Ravens. It is what it is, bro. It is what it is. You just wish them the best and hope they don't do anything to cause you any any harm. And you you hope you really hope you don't play them. Um, sadly, with McNair, we had to play him. <laughs> it sucks, bro. It sucks, bro. Uh, Papa C says it's okay. We got uh, Henry's replacement Spears. It's gonna be fucking. He's gonna be a fucking dog, right? Ta. Hell yeah, bro. Ty J Spears. We got a uh, Tony Pollard as well. And, and like I said, Will Levis is gonna have a legitimate threat. Out of the backfield, catching the ball, running the ball at the uh, dual threat running backs, um, hundred percent of the time, and and Pollard every time he comes in, he could be healthy. You can even, like I said, design plays where they're both out there at the same time next to next to uh, Will Levis, and that'll give defenses a lot of headaches. Uh, and I and I believe Bill Call uh, Brian Callahan's going to do that. Uh, I really feel like with his mind, his offensive scheme, his his um, the way that he's trying to develop and bring in the guys to make this offense go when when Malik Neighbors is a Tennessee Titan y'all but y'all better start rethinking that Titans are just going to start losing you keep stacking the box we're going over the top go ahead and then if you want to put your your lone safety on uh on Neighbors over there go ahead D hops one on one we all saw what he did last year i don't think he's slowing down yet remember D hops not known for his speed he's known for just being everything else great no flaws except top speed literally Let's get those likes up, fellas. We got 80 people watching. Let's go. We're not even halfway done, bro. Come on. Get those likes up. Subscribe. Comment. Let's go. We're live every single day. This is that thank you, Derrick Henry moment. We're talking everything free agency, too. If you like another team and you want to ask a question, you want it read off, you want to talk about it, ask questions. I don't know. I don't just know Tennessee Titans, baby. Ask those questions. Let's get it going. NFL free agency 2024 is here. This fucking season is active, fellas. Let's go. We're just getting started. The Chiefs cannot three-peat. Can I get a Chiefs cannot three-peat in the chat? No more of that shit. I'm done seeing that ketchup and mustard bullshit winning Super Bowls. Uh-uh. I'm done. I hope you guys are done too. Everybody in the AFC. Everybody in the NFC. Line up together and let's beat these bitches out of the Super Bowl. No three-peat. I'm done. I'm done with the Chiefs. I'm done with them winning. Taylor Swift, Travis Kells, Patrick Mahomes, and his fucking beer belly dad bod. Everything else in between. Get the fuck out of here. Somebody else has got to win. Somebody else has got to win. Come on. Ah. <laughs> What's up, Aiden? What's up, everybody? I love it, man. Uh, Schwa says, had to buy my second Henry jersey before the sales... Uh, hit just for what he's meant. I see what you're saying. Yeah. And for all the people who are like, oh man, I got to get a new jersey, blah, blah, blah. You, you can always get a new jersey for sure. You can always get a new jersey. But but check this out. But check this out. Derrick Henry's a legend. Greatest ever in this team's history. So it's like, you could wear that. You could wear your Derrick Henry jerseys forever. Forever. Go swimming in it. Who gives a shit? Go shopping in it. Go show it off. Go go walk down the aisle at the 99 cent store and give someone a stiff arm. See if they see if they don't like it a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Say, excuse me, stiff arm, boom. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. You don't have to ever worry about throwing throwing away a Derrick Henry jersey. You don't ever have to do that. Hang it up on your wall. It's a legend. He's a fucking living legend. Ravens, just please use him right because if you don't, I'm coming for all of your YouTubers. I'm gonna come for all of your YouTubers and, and be like, what the fuck are you guys doing? Use the king, man. He's king purple pigeon now. King purple pigeon. Get it done, bro. Come on, man. It's crazy. We got 100 people watching. Let's go, man. 100 people watching. We ain't even halfway done. I appreciate you guys. Continue to show that love, that support. Like, comment, subscribe. Remember, we're going to be live tomorrow again, either 8.30, uh, uh, 6.30 to 7, we're going to start. And we're only 10 subscribers away from 13,500. Take, let, let's take a pause for the cause while we hit that 30-minute mark. We're only 10, 10 subscribers away. Let's get that real quick. Come on, y'all. Pause for the cause. Let's get it, y'all. 10 subscribers away. Make sure y'all get that. We ain't even halfway done. Tennessee Titans, y'all. For all the people just jumping in here wondering, who the hell is this guy? <laughs> no, I'm not the blue Bret Hart. I'm T.A. You can't spell Titans without putting that T.A. in it. Y'all, check this out. Derrick Henry is a purple pigeon. Derrick Henry signs a deal, a two-year deal with the Baltimore Ravens to be 
King Purple Pigeon. All right, we'll see how that works out, right? We'll see how, how that works out. I know a lot of us Titans fans hate the pit Purple Pigeons. We don't like them. We get that. But it's better than him going to anybody in the AFC South. That is unacceptable, and that could not have happened. I love it, bro. I love it. Uh, Bruce says, what's up, Titan Anderson? Well, Colts GM, Chris Ballard ain't done jack shit for us. We'll not go after any any big anybody big in free agency. I'm already calling our division winners for this season, Texans or Titans. Wow, we've got a Colts fan jumping in there and really mad that they just keep re-signing the same players that didn't really bring them anything. That's interesting. I like this guy. This is a Colts fan that I like, man. High five to you, buddy. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. When Colts fans admit that their team is ass, oh, man, we're best friends, bro. Appreciate you. Did we just become best friends? Yep. I love it, bro. Let's go. Christian says, uh, hey, y'all, is is it just the sad? What? Is it just sad part is just the most greatest running back end up going to another team for the rest of our careers? He probably will, bro. He's probably going to be. He'll probably finish it out at the Ravens. Uh, if, if for some reason, I mean, look, let's be honest, he's going to retire a Titan. He'll sign a one day contract eventually with the Tennessee Titans, come back and plant that sword, hold up his, his crown and everything else, man. It, literally it'll happen, bro. It will happen. He, he'll eventually come back to Nashville. He'll eventually, you know, everything like that will happen right now. He's going to try to do his thing while we're doing our thing. We're going to, we're just taking a little bit of a separation. Sometimes separations are good. It's not bad. So uh, it's okay, man. It's okay. Derrick Henry, thank you again. Thank you so damn much for stiff arming so many kitty cats out of those trees. Thank you so much for making so many of those, those Jaguar fans really unhappy, really miserable when they knew you were playing, when you were coming to town, or when they were going to town to play you. I really, really am appreciative of everything you did. 99 yards on them, they have to live with that forever. They have to live with that forever, that you tossed them around like a Chucky doll. It was nice, man. And my reaction to that was, oh, my God. I think everybody's reaction to that was like, oh, my God, he's going to do it. One Jaguar, there he goes, boom, throwing him off. There goes another one. It's like, what the fuck is going on? And then, again, touchdown, Derrick Henry, 99 yards. Um, thank you for that. Thank you for everything, bro. All those, all the stiff arms, all the touchdowns, all the crowns, all the throwing touchdowns, young Peyton Manning everything he's ever done but now it's a memory it's just memories you know what would be fun if the titans shocked the world and were way better than everyone expects we go to the playoffs this year whether people like it or not and we see derrick henry and the purple pigeons in the playoffs how would you guys feel about that Tennessee Titans against the Baltimore Ravens in the playoffs. Man, tell me that wouldn't sell some tickets. I would go. I don't give a damn if it's on Mars, your grandma's patio. I don't care if it's on the dumpster truck's back fucking fender. I don't care if it's in the front pool yard. I'm going. Derrick Henry versus the Titans in the playoffs. Tell me y'all wouldn't go. You fucking lying, bro. You could not. Come on, bro. That would be crazy. Uh, Chief Rand says, I got a need for Sneed. <laughs> That's a good one, bro. Everyone's saying thank you, Henry. I appreciate everybody for being real like that. Man, y'all are awesome. Everybody's saying thank you. Viper, Burning Devil, Nodwin, Titanus, uh, Kat Nelson, uh, Aguilar, fucking uh, Al Pierce. Everybody, bro. Everybody. Supreme Nick got a funny question, or not really, comment. Titans got to earn uh, stadium tickets now. We'll see who puts asses in seats now. But I tell you what, with uh, with Will Levis and, and Jeffrey Simmons, I think we'll be okay. Will Levis seems like a guy who's going to take the league, league by storm. I really believe that. I love it, bro. I love it. Bruce Cox, I appreciate you dissing your own team. And nobody likes the Colts anyway, so it's all good. Nobody likes the Colts, so it's all good. Like, you know what I mean? Shizzy says thank you. Everybody, bro. Everybody. Matthew, thank you, King Henry. Yeah. The Texans go out there and fucking get... Man, come on, bro. They got to stop signing all these people. It's starting to get annoying. It's starting to get annoying, bro. Hell yeah. I know Derrick Henry not here is going to be difficult, right? You, you guys think it's going to be weird, too, seeing him in that purple? What the fuck are we looking at? Did he fall in the, in the paint aisle at Walmart? What's going on here? Holy shit. Derrick Henry in fucking purple. That's crazy. 
I know, yeah, he's the most respectful Colt of all time right now. It's crazy. Uh, let's see. Ronald says, uh, Ravens will use Henry to keep all the burden from falling on Lamar. That should go far. Come on, Gus Edwards. That's funny, bro. We'll see what happens. I think they need to use Henry the same way that they always do, bro. You know what I mean? He said, I already got my jersey hanging up. That's cool. That's what I'm talking about, bro. What's up, Titanium? Chris, how you doing, bro? It's good to see you, man. It's been a while. Angela, everybody in the building. Damn, there's a lot of people, bro. I appreciate y'all. He said, Bucks are better. My team made to the playoffs and Titans did not. I mean, but you're still watching a Tennessee Titans uh, YouTuber, so, uh, and, I, and I'm not watching a Bucks YouTuber, so we're even. How about that? <laughs> Holy shit, I love it, man. Uh, Crystal Bridges says, I like your hat. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, let's go Spears, man. Let's go Spears. Let's go Spears. Another person. Are you from, <laughs> are you from Tennessee? You're only 10 IC. That's hilarious. That's funny as fuck. Yeah, I know. Are you guys ready for football season without Derrick Henry? Are you guys ready? I'm not, I don't know how to take this. It's so strange, bro. It's so strange, bro. It's so strange. I don't even know how to accept this yet. It's, it's so weird, man. This is crazy. It's all good, though. Uh, Z1 says Cowboys on top. The Cowboys, bro. I'm surprised y'all didn't go get Derrick Henry. Y'all ex explain that to me. Why not, bro? Why not? What the fuck are you guys doing? Who did you guys get? Who did the Cowboys get? What running back? What tomato can did y'all grab? Who was it? What, run what, what tomato can ass running back did you guys grab from fucking? Come on, bro. Like, for real, where are we at? Someone put it in the, in the chat section. I can't remember who the fuck they brought in. I know, the fucking Texans got Daniel Hunter and Will Anderson, bro. That's crazy. That's bullshit. Yeah, man, we reached over 100 twice already, man. It's, it's, it's going up and down. Make sure you guys subscribe, man. Join us for all live stream. We're live every single night, bro. Every single night, bro. It's crazy. He said Walmart toilets. Yeah. <laughs> Angela says, TA, I love the king. It's going to be hard to watch next season. I'm a Titan till death. Love my team. Just wish we could have just kept the king. We all do. Literally, Angela, we all do. Um, my wife is literally damn near in tears about it. Like, dead ass serious. She's so upset about it. She has not even been, like, she's not even happy at all, bro. Like, she is a legitimate Derrick Henry and Jeffrey Simmons fan, so... Thank God Jeffrey Simmons is here. Otherwise, she probably would have fucking just gave up on football. <laughs> oh, man. I love it, man. Uh, Keem says, my gut hurts that King Henry is on another team. It sucks, bro. It's life, though. It is what it is. Michael says, Titans going to beat the, uh, the Ravens in next year's AFC Championship game next season. Can you imagine? Can you fucking imagine that game? Wow. Wow. Fallen Angel says, I'm still waiting for the Titans to win a Super Bowl. Trust me, we are too, buddy. We are too, buddy. I love it, bro. This is crazy, man. I appreciate everybody for being here. Everybody's dominating in the chat. That chat section's on fire, man. Spam Derrick Henry. Let's go, you guys. Spam Derrick Henry in the chat section. Let everybody know what's going on. This is crazy. Michael Lim says, Denard will have this defense popping. I'm, that's the plan, bro. Mr. Jones says, screw Rancarthon. You're out of your mind, bro. Rancarthon is building us a fucking beast. Mr. Jones says, I'm from Baltimore, huge Titans fan and Henry fan. Hey, bro, it's going to be interesting to see how people react to him out there. for Because for so long, they hated him out there. So it's weird, bro. Uh, uh, Chelsea says, is Derrick Henry the number one running back in the nation? I don't, I mean, I, he's up there. He's up there. He's up there. It depends how they want to use him, though. I think that's just a given, though. Uh, Zenberry says, burn those Henry jerseys. You're out of your fucking mind. You're out of your fucking mind. Who says that? Strange, bro. You a strange dude, bro. I know it's going to be like, well, once we go into week one and Derrick Henry's not there, bro. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ty J Spears throw on the dark visor and, and it'll be like, honey, I shrunk the baby. Or it, wasn't it? I blew up the baby. Shit, I got it wrong. You guys get what I'm saying, bro. Oh, man, this is crazy. I still can't. It doesn't seem real. I'm going to be honest. It doesn't seem real. Does it seem real to you guys? Does it really feel like Derrick Henry is gone? It doesn't seem real, right? This shit does not seem real. I feel like I'm going to wake up, bro. Like, I feel like I'm getting ready to wake up. This is nuts. Drippy says Titan's not making it. Yeah, maybe not next year, but next year we're going to show a lot of people. 
we're going to show a lot of people uh, what Will Levis is and who that is. So go ahead. Everyone can continue to doubt the Titans. That's fine. Titans have low key been signing a lot of really good players. So it's all good. Danny uh, Ferreira says Mixon is raw. Mixon's pretty good when he's healthy. Pretty good when he's healthy. That's for sure. Oh man, I know a lot of the a lot of you guys. I see your guys' comments, man. A lot of you guys. I see a lot of you guys' comments, man. A lot of you guys are upset about it. I get it, bro. I get it. It sucks. It sucks, bro. But it's okay. What's up? Hi. How you doing, buddy? Oh man, this is crazy. Um, Mamba says Cowboys ain't landing no free agent. They're gonna be shit forever. I thought they got a running back. They didn't get a running back. So what are they gonna stick with? A uh, little four foot four Vaughn? Deuce Vaughn? Oh, what's his name? Jacques Vaughn or Deuce Vaughn or whatever his name was. That's rough, bro. They better figure that one out. Man, this is crazy, bro. It just it just doesn't seem real. It still does not seem real. I know everyone's like bye bye Henry bye bye. He said blue Bret Hart. <laughs> Someone called me Bret Hart, bro. Like they're like, oh, you're trying to be Bret Hart. I just started laughing. I was like, you're crazy, bro. I'll put that bitch in the sharpshooter, though. I'll tell you that much. I'll make him tap out. You grow up with two brothers. You learn wrestling moves, bro. You learn how to do sharpshooters and throw elbows and throw straight rights. <laughs> oh shit. I love it, bro. Hey, all, all you Titans fans that showed up today, even all you football fans, if you guys are new to the chat, let us know in the comment section below so we can say what's up. Put it in the comment section so we can say what's up in the chat, you guys. If you guys are new to the ch new to the uh, to the channel, uh, if you guys are back again, put it in the chat section. Let us know. Let's go, baby. We back again. Another live stream, you guys. Free agency has been wild again. Derrick Henry no longer Tennessee Titans. Uh, Tennessee Titans are just gonna have to live with it and deal with it. Crazy. I love it. I love it, man. On to new things. Hopefully, it's better things. Hopefully, it's better things. Oh, this is crazy. Uh, he said Titans will be lucky to win three games. Is that what you said? Ooh, it's wild, bro. You really think so? I don't think so. It's crazy. Someone asked me, hey, T.A., you think you're going to make it to the, uh, you think you're going to make it to the, to the playoffs? I said, I hope so. I just, I don't know the team we're going to have. And then, People act like no team ever turns it around in one year. Like, we weren't that, like, we had a lot of core pieces. We were pretty broken, but we had a lot of core pieces. I mean, we had our defensive anchor and we had our quarterback. So um, those are really big things to have, you know, having that veteran on the outside and D-hop, you know what I'm saying? So we were we were able to, and in all that money, we're, we're bringing in guys that are going to build this team up and, and have us ready to go. If this chemistry matches up quicker than anyone expects, then we could be right back in it fighting and competing. Because like I said, I seen a special, special quarterback last year. I seen a quarterback when given time looks elite and looks like a superstar. So again, he didn't have much time last year, which sucks. But when he did have time, Will Levis fucking made everybody look like child's play. That guy was up in people's faces. He even told fucking... Willie Rocket even told DeAndre Hopkins, he told D-Hop, he's like, bro, come on, let's go, man. Come on, we're playing games. Catch that ball, bro. You got to be over here. And D-Hop even was like, oh, man, he got my respect. He's got my respect. Matthew says, it doesn't seem real that first game and his big ass isn't back there. It's going to be freaking hard. It's going to be weird, bro. Fucking weird, bro. What's up, Joker? Yeah, he didn't get traded. He just signed a contract. But I get what you're saying. Uh, Danny says, love the stream. Thanks for all the info. G, I appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you, bro. He says, how tall are you? How tall am I? I'm uh it 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 just depends what shoes I'm wearing, you know what I'm saying? If if I'm if I'm in my if I'm in my Titans, my Titan slides, I'm about like six seven. And then if I'm if I'm in like my my boots, then I'm like I'm like five five eleven, five twelve. 513 you know what i'm saying um but yeah it just depends what i'm wearing you know what i'm saying <laughs> oh that's funny how tall am i that's I don't, I don't you know it's funny that that's one of the things that most people i mean i've been asked that before but very 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 rarely i i get asked that very rarely at all the most thing i get asked honestly is uh where am i from or why am i a titans fan he says he says uh not a real crown wow holy fuck Calm down, Sherlock Holmes. Calm down, Sherlock Holmes. Joker says, I'm new. Okay, that's what's up, bro. He says, Crown Royal. Hey, there you go, bro. There you go. I love it, man. 
fucking dude's dude. That guy's tiny, bro. He's little. He is little as hell, bro. That's crazy. Mr. Jones says, watch Henry run for 2,000 yards in Baltimore. Dude, if that happens, Titans fans will go nuts. Uh, Mac G says, T.A., you think we'll get Snead or Chase Young? I mean, I hope we get all of them. <laughs> I hope we get everybody. Uh, but we got to be realistic and bring in the right guys. Um, I hope that we bring in somebody soon. I hope that we bring in somebody soon. Um, I would like to bring in a DB, whether it's a safety, a corner, um, both. <laughs> we need to do that. We need to... We need to uh, we need to beef that up a little bit and, and uh, solidify that a little bit better. Dr. Victor says, go sports, get them points. Woo, it matters. Holy crap, dude. Who dropped you on your fucking head? That's crazy. <laughs> damn, imagine coming in here and saying that. You must be so unhappy, bro. You must be so damn unhappy. I feel so bad for you. I'm so sorry. Damn, bro. Go sports. Go get them. Jesus, bro. You had bad chicken wings, didn't you? You had bad fucking chicken wings. Patrick says, so what kind of compensatory pick uh, will we get since he signed elsewhere? I'm not sure. If you guys know, let, let us know in the chat, man. Uh, Michael M says, Baltimore won't know how to use Henry. I think they will. I think they will. I don't think they would have signed him if they didn't do their homework. Oh, man. The Iron Sheik's in the building. That's what I'm talking about, man. The Iron Sheik, bro. One of the goats. One of the fucking goats. I got dissed by the Iron Sheet. Gotta love it. You gotta love it! <laughs> oh, he's a Jaguars fan. Dude, the Jaguars are gonna be so bad, you guys. Their fans are gonna be so pissed off. Their fans are gonna be so pissed off about everything, bro. Like, I could guarantee you that. I could guarantee you that. They went out and got their quarterback replacement. I love it, bro. I love it. It's great. Good, good shit, you guys. Good shit. Uh, Ernesto Garcia says, I'm super sad we're losing Henry. Everybody is, bro. It sucks. It sucks. But it is what it is. It can't, we can't do nothing about it. He's a purple pigeon. Um, he has his opportunity to go try to ring chase. We'll see if that works out for him. We'll see if it works out for him. But they better give him 20-plus carries. If they don't, it's not going to work. Won't even get close. Uh, Ernesto says, how do you feel about us signing a new center? Uh, Christian Berry, I'm very happy about it. I think that's the best, the best uh, thing we've done in the offseason uh player wise picking up guys so far since since this has opened up um he solidifies the center position and he's amazing he's a top five pass pro um he's way bigger than brewer brewer is brewer is listed at five foot two 145 pounds and um cushion berry is six three what they say 317 ish something like that so he's a lot bigger <laughs> he's a lot bigger bro uh yeah the, our new offensive line is gonna be a fucking he's gonna be a beast down there bro he's gonna be a beast he says we just signed another offensive tackle yeah that's crazy bro i'll have to check it out bro i'm, I'm gonna have to check that shit out I'm not really sure sigma says i hate the titans damn damn it y'all have a lot of crazy energy today y'all are like real upset it's crazy jr says i'm gonna miss big <laughs> big henry but i'm excited for the complete change of scheme staff and personnel me too bro it's it, it's on to new things bro and here we go and here we go he's uh captain egghead says this is sad uh sigma says screw the titans they suck damn you are an unhappy person texans for life says nice jersey i appreciate you bro appreciate you got that split captain's patch you know what's up Uh, Ernesto says, laughing my ass off, love the Brewer stats. I mean, I've got to be close, right? I mean, I can't be that far off. The dude's too damn small. Damn, the dude's too damn small. I love it, bro. I fucking love it. Uh, Matthew says, can't wait to see Mac Jones <laughs> running those kitty cats at some point. They're going to be so bad. Bro, Trevor Lawrence is going to get passed up in like 10 minutes, bro. I can't wait. I love it. I fucking love it uh j park says cowboys are crying right now i can't stand them bro hey what are you guys thinking about the nfl draft man we haven't talked anything nfl draft i get it i get it y'all i get it free agency you know everybody's sitting here ready but it was quiet today with everything that's happened in the free agency everybody that's watching almost 100 people still put your team name in caps and put the player that you want to draft put one or two players don't put three put one to two players that you would like to draft for the upcoming draft and we'll talk about it real quick uh, while we're still kind of just going over everyone's comments and talking Derrick Henry and free agency. 
because this is nuts right now. All the Titans fans are still fucking all over the place. Uh, all the NFL is sitting here like, what the hell did the Tennessee Titans really just trade away? Like, or not trade away, but allow uh, Derrick Henry to really go. And people need to realize it just was time. It was time. He wanted to try something else. You know what I'm saying? We wanted to go in a different direction with with uh, all the new faces in the building, in the franchise. And that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Let Derrick Henry eat. Let us eat. I hope he has success. I hope it works out for him. But I hope it works out for us more. I hope we have better success. We're the Tennessee fucking Titans. He's with the Purple Pigeons. Love you, Derrick Henry. Love everything you did for us. But you joined the Purple side. You joined the Purple purple Pigeons. Those stupid birds. Those dumbass birds that are always flying down and picking up trash. That's what you joined, Derek. You ditched us. You handed in your sword. You handed in your sword for some fucking feathers. Come on, Derek. You handed in your sword for some fucking feathers. Oh, man, it's going to be so weird, man. Thank God we got Ty J. Shakespeare, a.k.a. the barber, out there giving people cuts on Sundays. Wild, man. Derrick Henry, man. We love you, man. We love you. We are so thankful for everything you did for this team. Do not do not think we do not appreciate you at all. All right, here we go. Let's get into your guys' comments on who y'all want to draft. Um, Captain Egghead says his team's the Titans. He wants Marvin Harrison Jr. I love it, bro. Jay Park says, need O-line. This free agency determines who we pick up in the draft. Uh, Texans for life says Texans and, uh, a lineman, a wide receiver, no names, but specific, uh, position. Okay. I can respect that. Mamba mentality says Texans for life. Uh, what we can do for you. I'm wait, what? <laughs> Michael says Marvin Harrison Jr. Neighbors alt. I'm the same thing. Uh, Romer says Cowboys better. JR. <laughs> oh my God. Cowboys fans. JR Brewer, a fullback at, at center. LOL. He's so small, bro. Mac G says Titans. Ariel Carter says Mar Marvin Harrison Jr. are neighbors. Andy Lafton says Jets, neighbors. Ooh. Kaylee Walkup says, look at the drip. Appreciate it. Yep. We try to stay, we try to stay as uh as as um, you know what I'm saying, as put together as possible. Uh OZ says Titans are favorites to win. Hey, I hope we I hope we just shock the world and, and are way better than people expect. I, that's what I really hope. Uh Captain Egghead says, we are now, or we are a passing team now, Titan Anderson. And we've got the right quarterback to throw the football. <laughs> Sawed off shotgun, Uzi submachine gun style release, man. Just bam, bam, bam. Rocket launcher. Rocket launcher of an arm. Oh, I can't wait to see this. I can't wait to see this. I can't wait to call every single game. Yazzie says, when the Titans going to get a ring? Well, I remember my first beer. Nice comeback, kid. Uh, John Sports says, take the crown off, little bro. You hear people, you, you hear these trolls. It's so funny, right? So funny. Somebody check how many subscribers he is so we can so I so I can go check on him. Hey, if you're over 5,000, bro, me and you, one-on-one, one-on-one -on -one, one -on -one sports debate. You don't want it. You don't want it. You don't want it. And if you beat me, I'll take the crown off. How about that? And if I beat you, then you have to buy a crown just to put it on and say, I look stupid. That's what you have to do because you would lose, definitely. You would definitely fucking lose. I love this team, man. Everybody should. If you're a Titans fan and you don't love this team, you're crazy, bro. Uh, Danny says, Tennessee, Bowers, Alleman, uh, ooh. Olu, really? Ooh, I didn't expect that. He said Bowers or Olu. I didn't expect that. I like it. Katie says, rest in peace, Titans. Katie's lost. Katie took a wrong turn. All right. Um, Mr. Jones says, we didn't make Henry a priority. It's just, I don't think it was even about that. I just think that he just, him and us probably had a conversation and said it's time to just separate on, on good terms. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I, I truly believe that's how it went down. I truly believe that. Jay Beat says, I either want Xavier Leggett or Romadans uh, or Troy Franklin. I Troy Franklin in the second round, dude, he's so fast with pads on. It's crazy, bro. Yeah, buddy. Uh, Jay Park says, wouldn't mind picking up... Uh, add an eye from uh from texas or any texas receiver or 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 alt i uh i think texans have really good receivers honestly 
Uh, both of them are really good. Both of them are really fast and quick. Um, but Joe, all I would rather have Joe all over both Texas receivers personally. Um, but again, it just depends on, uh, you know, obviously finishing out the free agency and go, uh, pretty much finishing it out and going into the draft. Um, we'll have a better tunnel vision on that for sure. But uh, I think a lot of people are going to be interested on Joe Alt for sure. Uh, some people were worried about his his strength from uh, from his bench pressing, and I don't think that should even matter. Um, you're not bench pressing people back there. You know what I'm saying? It's just weird to me. A lot goes into balance and technique and other things. I'm not going to you know spill everything, but it is what it is. Uh, and let teams pass on him because I'm sure that the Titans would have a really hard time passing on him at seven. Yes, sir. Uh, your favorite blonde says, what's your opinion on the Chiefs? I'm just tired of them winning, to be honest. Just tired. I think everyone's tired. Uh, Logan says, Jets for life, the best O-lineman in the draft board. Hey, Amen. Okay, I can respect that. I can respect that. He says, more passes equals more interceptions. That's true. That is true. That's crazy, bro. That is crazy. That's right. Let people let let people doubt us. It's all good. Not gonna end the world. The Titans are washed. I'm so, that's bad. <laughs> people got me fucked up. I love it, man. Uh, Big Rig is that his name? Says Henry lost his crown when he left Tennessee. Until he puts that purple pigeon jersey on. <sighs> Photoshop doesn't count. <laughs> uh, we're gonna put the the crown back over there. If you're, a, if you're if you're a true Derrick Henry fan, true Tennessee Titans fan, and you can't you can't sit there and hate him for this. Who knows if the guys the Titans are going to bring in are going to be good? Hopefully, so that we can compete, make everyone look stupid. But we'll see, fellas. We'll see. I'm excited, bro. Uh, Captain says Tony Pollard and Spears are fast as fuck and could be a wide receiver. You can use them as weapons. You can literally use them as weapons, and it's it, that's big time. Michael says, Titans neighbors, you know what's up. You know what's up. Uh, Katie keeps saying Titans are washed for whatever reason. I don't know what she's, what's, what's up with that. <laughs> I don't know what's up. It's so strange to me. We got over 50 likes, fellas. I appreciate y'all. I appreciate y'all. Y'all are great, man. Continue to subscribe, man. Subscribe, hit that like button. Good job, fellas. We just got it, man. Let's go. 13,500 subscribers, man. Let's give it up for you guys, man. Appreciate y'all so much. This channel's growth has been insane lately. Uh, continue to share this out. Continue to subscribe. Continue to leave likes. Continue to show that support, man. I appreciate y'all. That's crazy. That's crazy. 13.5, fellas. 13.5. Yeah, buddy. What's up, Dave? How you doing, buddy? Uh, Bear says, quick shout out, Eddie George. Yes, sir. Uh, Jay Park says, love the gear and the microphone, by the way. I appreciate you, bro. Yes, sir. Hell yeah. Uh, Eric Carter says, w uh, wonder what defensive end Titans pick in the draft for Autry replacement. I want Eric Armstead to hurry up and get in here, bro. Like, let's just bring him in and put him where Autry is and say, let's go, bro. You and Big Jeff together. What do you guys think about Eric Armstead uh, 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 coming in to be next to Jeffrey Simmons? Put it in the chat section. Light it up. Crazy, bro crazy hopefully bro jr says i hate the chiefs colors yeah the chiefs colors are fucking ugly fucking ugly anthony says i sub i appreciate you anthony thanks buddy uh yeah higgins uh, dude titans are gonna do something big titans are I, I said it earlier titans are either getting uh higgins or sneed hell they might get both but one of them's gonna be a titan there ain't no fucking way Rand carthon lets both of them get away hell no Higgins or Sneed, fellas, if you were to get, if you had to get one, put it in caps. Higgins or Sneed, which one do you want? Jeremy says, take off the glasses. You're a hater, Jeremy, and you're here all the time, so there's no point in saying that. Uh, Mad Knights uh, 101 says, Purple Pigeon jersey is stupid when your team hasn't won the Super Bowl in the last 20 years and your team hasn't made the playoffs in the last two. Okay. <laughs> Uh, JR says, Katie has a Toronto Maple Leaf as her profile pick. That explains so much. She, Yeah, she probably has no idea about football. That's probably what it is. Or she's a uh, low-key a Bill fan or some shit. <laughs> Rodney says, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm a big Henry's fan, but he's not going to win a Super Bowl with Lamar because Lamar always falls in the end of the playoffs. He does. But now he has a king to rely on. Now he can allow the Derrick Henry to, to just go crazy in the playoffs. 
that's what they're bringing him in for, bro, to try to take that next step. Uh, Captain says, uh, Egghead says Higgins. Uh, Titanus says Sneed. Kangsta says Sneed. Um, Ariel Carter says Sneed. Uh, Captain says Higgins keeps posting pics of his Tennessee high school. It's all over the place, bro. He wants to come home. Pink Ninja says nice hat. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Make sure you guys subscribe, you guys. A lot of new faces, man. A lot of new faces. I appreciate all you guys. You guys are kicking ass today. You guys are really kicking ass today. We got another live stream tomorrow, too. I know, I know, I know, yes, uh, I know that today is mostly focused on Derrick Henry and stuff and not a lot happened with the Titans. Um, and I got started late, fellas, so I apologize. Uh, but tomorrow, fellas, tomorrow is going to be another at least hour half show. And, and the tie. <laughs> I know something's coming. I know something's coming. Something's big's coming. And it's it, it's going to be something to where it's like Titans are, are ready to compete. Titans are going to compete right now. Titans are ready to fight. I'm so excited, y'all. If you guys should be too. You guys should be too. If you're a Titans fan, even if you're a football fan, are you guys ready for football? Who's ready for, who's ready for some football? It, a chat section, light it up. Light it up. Write football. Everybody write football and just spam that shit. Come on, bro. I'll write that shit, too. Come on, you guys. Football. Let's get it, man. I am so fucking excited for football. Let's go, bro. I'm so excited. Football's back. I'm so excited we're talking football and we're live, man. We're able to get guys, let guys go. The draft is fucking creeping up. So is my birthday. Everything's coming into place. Again, we lost the king, but he had a great career over here. I love it, bro. I love it, man. Let's just let's just do this the right way, man. Let's do this the right way. It's going to be the first time that I've ever ever done YouTube without Derrick Henry. First season. First season covering the Tennessee Titans without mentioning Derrick Henry touchdown. Wow. DeAndre says stop at Rams house. Hey, man. I'm going to I'm going to be in L.A. when we play you. I was there last time when we beat your ass. So <laughs> hopefully you guys can get your little revenge on us, because if not, I'm going to be walking or walking out of the stadium to my fucking car, driving it back to San Diego with a fat smile on my face again. Yes, sir. I love it. What's up, K. Will? Don't see you much, man, but I appreciate you when you're here, bro. Or maybe you just don't comment much. I don't fucking know. Nod Wynn says we got this T.A. tighten up. I appreciate you, bro. Matthew, I'm so ready for football. We all should be, bro. <laughs> Titanus says, "How have I not seen some of these mods before? Some of them, some, some of them just, I don't know, just don't come around as much. I guess I don't know, but Cable's always been solid for me, bro. Known him for a long time. Uh, hell yeah, bro. Travis, how you doing, buddy? How you doing, Travis? Make sure you hit that subscribe button, buddy. Uh, Captain Egghead says, Levis, the first Titans quarterback to throw for four K yards in a season. Do you guys think that's gonna happen?" You guys think Will Levis is going to throw for 4,000 yards in the season? Put 4K and then yes or no in the chat. 4K, yes or no in the chat. You can figure out what you guys are thinking about that Will Levis situation. Uh, it's pretty crazy. It's just, it's so crazy because it's like everyone's counting the Tennessee Titans out. Everyone thinks the Titans just are not that good. It's funny. Uh, Katie says, Titans are washed. I am a guy. I'm just on my mom's account. I can't get on my own. That's fucking ridiculous, bro. Like you need to go, you, you need to stay in school, kid. Like for real, this is ridiculous. Someone snuck out of nap time and stole mommy's phone. Holy shit, bro. And don't come on, man. Is that what kids do nowadays? You don't fucking go into the refrigerator or fucking jump on top of the counter and go into the cookie jar. Like what is going on? Mr. Rugrat? This is crazy. Fuck dude. They better remake the Rugrats. Tommy Pickles is going to be on his iPad next time, teleporting around the building, bro. Like, this is crazy. What are we watching, bro? Little ass kids stealing their mom's phones, hacking into their mom's phones just to talk shit to the Titans. That's the, that's next level, bro. I don't think I've ever heard that one, bro. This is crazy. Little ass kids stealing their mom's phone just to talk shit. That's crazy. What world are we living in? Holy shit. A uh, random guy says, hype for Pollard, hashtag tighten up. We should be, bro. That's something that we don't talk about much, and he's great. He's great. Uh, Christian, okay, um, let's see. Nick says, Titans going crazy next year. Dude, I'm telling y'all, people keep sleeping on this. It's all good, bro. It's all good, bro. Uh, Michael says, 4K, yes. I think so. I think 4K is possible, you guys. Um, I, I think um, I think between 30 or 3,000 and 3,500, 
it is is almost going to happen in my opinion he's going to really launch the ball um the interceptions is something you may see uh increase for sure <laughs> but um he's going to give our guys opportunities and um that's going to that's going to be amazing um because we haven't we haven't had a quarterback that's willing to give our guys one on one opportunities consistently really ever like since McNair, to be honest like this is crazy uh and now we're going to have a guy that uh has a a rocket arm. He can throw 90 yards in pads. He has the quickest release in football and he's got an attitude to where, uh, you know, if, if, if you hit him low, if you, if you got a problem with the Titans, he's going to, he's going to tell you, he's going to get in your face and tell you to tighten up. And, uh, and he's going to tell you that he's better than you. So the Tennessee Titans got everything they could possibly want going for them right now. Uh, other than Derrick Henry leaving, <laughs> we've got a shitload of money. We've brought in a lot of guys to fill in holes already. Still got the draft and a shit ton of money. Um, so, so far, I think everybody should be happy. Titans fans, give us a grade right now. How are you feeling about this offseason grade? I got to give us a B plus. I think everything's been really, really good. Uh, I, I've got re really no questions about anything uh, because I, I, I have a feeling that uh, all the other answers are coming. You know, everyone's talking about Murray. Oh, he sucks. Blah, blah, blah. He just had his career year. Uh, very explosive in college. Very explosive in the NFL as well. Uh, hasn't been consistent for sure. Has injury issues for sure. But uh, last year was a amazing and he's going to be our number two someone else is coming continue to hate though continue to hate though he's he's very explosive and strong and 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 we're going to use him as a blitzer trust me trust me he is a uh he's like have you ever seen the water boy when 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 he's going boom and he goes and drop kicks you and shit go watch some of his highlights bro he'd be running at you like that he'd be running at you trying to kill people you get in his way he's gonna water boy your ass bro he ain't you better watch out. The Mud Dogs is coming on. You better watch out because again, Murray's very explosive and, and he's very strong. Um, does he take? Does he take? Uh, does he make mistakes? For sure, everybody does. Um, but last year, uh, coming off his, his best season as an NFL pro, uh, let's 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 bank on that. Let's see how it works. Let's see how it works. All right, man. Uh, Captain Egghead says. Uh, Crazy how fan ranked or FanDuel ranked Levis eight at quarterback ranked 32, laughing my ass off. Yeah, because that's because they're fucking ridiculous. They don't know nothing about football. They don't know nothing about football. Let me guess. They put Justin Fields ahead of him, right? Justin Fields doesn't even know how to throw a football down the field. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Everyone can everyone can fucking throw a football down the field and, and, and get it, you know, on target every once in a while. But I mean, consistently, come on, bro. This is getting crazy out there. You can't tell me there's 32 quarterbacks. There's 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 not even fucking 10 quarterbacks that can make those throws that Will Levis made. Maybe not even five. Will Levis is making throws, getting smacked right in his fucking face, still throwing the ball right on target, throwing the ball down the field. It goes off the screen damn near 90% of the time he throws it. He throws it so fucking high and far. It's crazy, bro. So let people keep sleeping on it. It's okay. Let the media sleep on it. They always do, though. They always do. They never give us any fly. They don't give us our dues at all. So who gives a shit? A uh, random guy says, we need a left tackle with that first round pick. It might happen, bro. It might happen. Mr. says, F, hater. Uh, Magnificent Merker says, the king has gone from AFC South. Woohoo. Uh, hater. <laughs> Mac G, A minus. Titanus, A minus. Captain Egghead, B. Nick Winter, B minus. Elite Curry says, I have a strong feeling at least going to the playoffs next year for sure. Will Levis, D Hop, the draft of loads of money. Still, I'm hyped. That's the thought process right there, uh, T Curry. I like that, bro. Black Bear says, Levis said in a video that the Titans are winning it next year. You didn't hear that with Tannehill. There's just a different mindset with him. He he really believes he's the best. He really believes like he's always going to win. And um, again, I see in that in that mentality, I think he's more fierce um, and he's stronger and stuff. But um, even Tom Brady says that that reminds him of himself, that type of leadership and fierceness that he has, that mentality. Um if he can if he can bottle it up and use it correctly, then uh, the Tennessee Titans are going to win a lot of football games and 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 we're going to have a lot of opportunities to win a Super Bowl with it with him at quarterback. Uh, Captain Egghead says Chase Snead or Higgins all or or all of the above, please. Hey man, hopefully we can get something something right. We'll see, bro. Nick says I'm only worried about this pass coverage. That's why I want to get Snead, bro. He's good. He's a good one. And then uh, Chidobi's a good one too, bro. Like, come on, man. That'd be a good-ass duo right there. Roger McCreary on the inside. That's nice, bro. 
Katie says the uh the only good player you have is D Hop, and he is crazy. You guys are so lucky. Man, I feel like I'm arguing with chalk. Like this is ridiculous. Are you kidding me? I feel like if I throw water on his comment, it'll just wash away. This kid's ridiculous. Jesus Christ. Go back in your ball pit, kid. This is crazy. What are we doing here? What are we doing here? This kid's crazy, man. Uh, Awaken says Levis has the strongest arm in the NFL. In pads, I guarantee you he throws farther than anybody. Anybody. Nick says the rankings are BS. I know. How do you have Will Levis as the, the 32nd ranked quarterback? That doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense at all. Damn, bro. Dorian says Titan signed new guard. He's good. Physical attributes, but lacks coaching and is injured a lot. Maybe Bill can coach him up. What's his name? Name drop, name drop, name drop. Elite Curry says rank 32 is ridiculous. Wait till the season. We will be a problem. Dude, I hear you, bro. I think we're going to be okay, though. I think there's a chance we could really still surprise some people. You know, I don't want I don't want anybody thinking that that the Titans are just going to be some type of walkover. I don't I don't I refuse to believe that. I refuse to believe that. Kangsta says uh, Tanny should should accept his role as a backup and resign. Didn't he go to the Dolphins or, or or did I just like read something fake about that? You guys let me know about that. Did I read something about that or was that fake? Or just maybe somebody said they wanted him to go. I don't know. Like I said, I was at work all fucking day. Hit that subscribe button, fellas. Hit that subscribe button. We're closing in on 13,550. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Oh, bro, what the fuck? Christian says, hey, T, I bet Katie and XD Gamer are friends that want to say random shit. Probably, bro, but it's all good. Let them talk their shit. Uh, random guy says people are going to continue to hate on Tennessee just like every year. It's it's weird, bro. It, it's just weird how that happens. It's like, what the fuck? Why? Like, I don't understand it. Like, people should use their, their energy on hating the Chiefs. They're the ones winning all the fucking games, not us. We, we're not even winning right now. Um, but we'll be involved soon. I'm not too worried about that. You know what I mean? Uh, let's see. Uh, EWO says, I feel like T is being traded here soon. Maybe by tonight. T Higgins or or uh, or Legereus Sneed's got to be a Tennessee Titans, fellas. Come on, bro. What are you guys thinking? Between T Higgins and Sneed, fellas. T Higgins and Sneed. What are you guys thinking? Who would you guys rather have? T Higgins or Sneed? T Higgins or Sneed, fellas. It's kind of, it's crazy because they're both really good, right? And they both could really help. Oh, man. Uh, maybe Sneed because we can still get a really good player in the draft. Uh, in the, you know what I'm saying? Not that we can't in the draft regardless on, on the other position, the other way, you know, yin and yang, but, uh, or vice versa, whatever. But it's like, oh, that's tough, bro. That's a tough one. Logan says T. Nick says T. Uh, Lone, Lone Star says Ayuk, I'm done. Uh, Captain Egghead says we got to get Higgins. I know Tennessee, he wants to be here. Like, there's so many connections, right? Mike says Higgins. Christian says, hey, T, I bet that Henry is way better than McCaffrey will ever be. I mean, they're both really good. I think Derrick Henry's just unique and special. I, I'd put him up against anybody. Like I said, nobody has two, six 200-yard games with two touchdowns or more. Nobody has more than three. He has six. You know what I mean? So Cody says Snead, Burks, and Chig are going to have a year. I, I hope Sneak comes over, bro. Him or T. Higgins would be huge, bro. You know what I'm saying? That would be big, bro. That would be really big. Uh, random guy says, Henry is a better running back overall, but McCaffrey has the better uh, takeoff who, uh, when handed the ball. Yeah, well, of course. Uh, Derrick Henry's acceleration is not the greatest. Of course, he's big as fuck. Uh, but, but you give him three, four steps, get out of his way. He's gone. Uh, Captain Egghead says crazy people hated Henry until he got to the Ravens. It's just how it is. People hate the Tennessee Titans, bro. People fucking hate the Tennessee Titans, bro. Oh, shit. Yeah, dude, people hate the Tennessee Titans. I don't understand it. It is what it is, though. Uh, Shadow says, as a Cowboys fan, you can have Tony Pollock. Bro, You and you can use that little four foot five running back. Good luck with that. Good luck with that. You guys fucked up by not going and getting Derrick Henry. That's what you guys fucked up with. Holy hell. Gallup, aren't you guys trading him? Man, y'all falling apart too. 
That's crazy. Uh, Logan says T and Hopkins would, would be a good duo. It'd be a great duo. Good luck with that. Luck says no more Henry. Ha ha ha. Yeah, that's that, that's funny as fuck. Yep. What's up, Pastel? What, how you doing, buddy? How you doing? We're just talking NFL free agency, you guys. We're just talking free agency. We got about 10, 15 more minutes, you guys. Get those comments in. Get that like button. Subscribe, you guys. Subscribe. We're going to be live again tomorrow. Tomorrow, uh, we're going to have a huge signing. You know it's coming. You know something's coming. So make sure you guys subscribe uh, and hit that uh, notification bell on so you know when it's coming. We also have channel Discord. Hit that Discord. We're live on there all the time. You got people 24-7 talking football, having a great time. So make sure you guys hit that link. A lot of my mods have been posting it throughout the night. Get your final questions in, fellas, on Derrick Henry, man. Get your final questions in on Derrick Henry. If you got any other final questions about Derrick Henry, anything free agency, NFL draft, man, get him in, get him in, get him in. Mac G says, we're not winning and people didn't hate the Pats when Brady was there. And JC, no, we're always hated when there are insanely good teams. That's not us. Dude, don't even worry about that. When, uh, all we got to do is focus on winning. Once we start winning, um, everything will fall into place. It'll get a lot. It'll get real fun. And don't worry, we're going to win. We got too many people on this football team that 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 hate losing, and that's important. That's very important. He says, "What's the Discord? Hit that Discord link. My mods are putting it out, man. Hit that hit that Discord link, fellas. Continue to subscribe because again, we are live every single day, bro. Every single day." Uh, random guy says, "Tier, you also a Nashville Predator fan? Yeah, I don't I don't care for hockey, bro, but I like Alexander Ovechkin. That's that's the guy I like. I don't even know if he still plays." Uh, Elite T. Curry says, it's sad to see Henry gone, but you got to do what you got to do to win. That's a fact, bro. It just sucks, man. Sucks, man. Derrick Henry, bro. Derrick Henry, man. We might retire that hat, bro. I'm just going to keep it 100. I might retire that hat. I might retire that hat. I don't even like looking at it. That's just pissing me off right now. <laughs> Uh, Derrick Henry, man. Thank you so much, Derrick Henry, bro. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much for what you've done for this franchise, man. You've changed everything, man. You've literally changed everything for us, bro. We're literally a way better franchise overall because of what you did, where you, where you took us, the new fans that we have, bro. The excitement, the wins. We almost were in the Super Bowl because of you. We were up 10 points two different times against those sorry-ass Chiefs. But again, Ryan Tannehill happened, and we ended up shitting the bed no diaper. Well, guess what? Thank you. Appreciate it. Memories for life. Will Levis, Ty J Spears, Big Jeff. Let's go. Let's go. It's our turn. New everything. And I'm here for it. Every day, live, Tennessee Titans, NFL, bring it. Your questions are heard. You guys got to understand something. This season is going to be the most unique season for me in my life, in my whole life, especially since YouTube. No Derrick Henry, none. No Derrick Henry. Titan Sal says, hopefully Titans make a splash tomorrow. It's going to happen, bro. CM says, do you think... Uh, Levis is going to have a breakout season. Of course, bro. I think last year was kind of like a breakout season. He was a beast, bro. Fucking hate the Colts. Next time you guys have to take a piss or number two at Walmart, think of that black helmet that the Colts have for their alternate pajamas. It looks like a Walmart toilet seat, right? Tell me I'm lying. Tell me I'm lying. Yeah, King Henry, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Awaken says Eddie George is better than Derrick Henry. You're out of your fucking mind respectfully respectfully bro like that's crazy why would you even say some shit like that uh e ewo says i wonder what picks we are offering kc for sneed apparently we are really hot on him i hope we get him bro i hope we get him i hope we get him get your final questions in, you guys get them in here hit that like comment subscribe continue to get it up guys appreciate everybody for subscribing appreciate everybody for showing up this is crazy man this is crazy Come on, y'all. We got 10 more minutes to go. We got 10 more minutes to go. Uh, Elite says, uh, King Henry, you will be missed. Uh, CM says, what's your opinion on the Week 14 Dolphins game? I love it. 
I loved it. I mean, my reaction to it was unbelievable. I actually uploaded, I uploaded, uh, um, like the whole fourth quarter or the whole comeback or whatever the fuck it was as a side video. Um, it was crazy. The craziest, craziest game, man. Will Levis was just unbelievable. DeAndre Hopkins was a star. Um, everybody was on fire, man. This team really fought and really showed heart. And to think that we were able to beat that Dolphins team with such a bad Titans team, special, special. Captain says, I will give pick seven for Higgins. It would be like pick seven for pick 18 and Higgins, right? Isn't that what it, the rumor is, supposedly? Some shit like that. Uh, CJ says, shit not looking good. We let three starters walk with holes everywhere. I actually think that the guys that we let go needed to go. To Nico, I would have been okay with him coming back, but he's, what is he, 35, 36 years old? Like, that's just, I don't know, fellas. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm a little unsure about that. Um, yeah, I mean, come on, bro. Like, he has be arguably his best season, right? But, like, he's old. So it's... And then Aziz, Aziz, I'll show you. He can't cover nobody, bro. Like, he he, he can tackle and stay he's good, but I was okay with letting him walk. Like, people are complaining about the guys that we got rid of. I, mean, I get Derrick Henry for sure, but, I mean, everybody else to me was just like, I don't think it was that bad. Uh, Aaron Judge says, what do you think about picking up Tony Pollard and Kenneth Murray? Uh, I mentioned a little bit about Kenneth Murray earlier. He's so explosive and strong, uh, and he's better as a blitzer. He, that's why he came off as his best uh, his best season last year as a pro. And I think that uh, uh, as a, one of our starting middle linebackers, he's going to do really well. I think he's going to do better than what people think. Uh, but we gotta, we got we to gotta rush the passer with him. He's so explosive. Um, Tony Pollard, I'm happy with. Um, Again, uh, we're always going to have a back now that can that is a dual threat back, and is they're both really good dual threat backs. They're not just like average or whatever. So I'm excited to see that. I think they could be a really really formidable one two punch. And uh, the Tennessee Titans are gonna are gonna go with a very very quick fast paced offense that's gonna really do work. I'm excited, bro. Are you guys excited about this football season? Are we all excited about this football season? SM said, "Would you rather pick up Snead or Higgins?" I I I, I want to say. I want to say Higgins. I think Snead is more important uh, because we can still address a, a receiver with the seventh pick. Uh, you know what I mean? So I think Snead would be more the more important thing to bring in, wouldn't you guys say? But I don't know. Let's bring them both in. Fuck it. Hey, I'm sorry, Wade, if you're serious. That sucks. Uh, Evo says, stay live for another like 30 minutes in case the trade, please. That's funny. We got, we got another like seven, eight minutes left, you guys. And we're going to be live tomorrow. Don't even worry about it. We're live every single day. Like I said, so, uh, get your questions in here, get them all in here. This is the channel to subscribe to. I promise y'all we're freaking growing at a rapid pace. We're climbing the ranks and, uh, we're not looking back. We're going to try to get as many subscribers as we can build this fan base up. So when these, when football season's here and we're all live, we're going to have the craziest conversation. We're going to have Madden uh, on PS5. Once the new Madden game comes out, we're going to be going one-on-one -on -one with a lot of you guys out there. Um, there's so there's so much coming, man. We're going to be having some group hangouts as well. But right now, we're just kind of doing the solo thing, kind of just going at you guys, letting you guys know who Titan Anderson is. Titan says, I cried about Henry. Hey, there's nothing wrong with that, man. That shows you're a true fan. That's all I can say. Stoner Titan says, imagine losing Henry, set a true uh, flame in Tennessee, and we become elite. Uh, I hope so. Random guy says, who wouldn't want to be a part of the live stream? You're a legend, TA. Hey, I appreciate that, bro. I appreciate that. Um, again, uh, the more people who continue to show up and become regulars, the bigger these these audiences are going to be. Uh, this is the second or third show in a, in a row that we've we've cracked the over 100 people watching uh, now. And, and it seems like it's becoming a regular thing. So again, every time you guys, uh, every time you guys are... Um, you know what I'm saying? Around this time, around roughly, we're, we're usually live. So um, this is a good time to subscribe. Hit that bell for notification alert. And again, we are lot, we're, we're talking sports, NFL all the time in the Discord. Hit that Discord link and you will definitely know when we're, when we're going live. Uh, because we go live every day, but sometimes it's different times. So uh, Connor says, yo, I love this stream. I'm so glad I found this again. I appreciate you, Connor. Thanks, buddy. 
Uh, Mark Lee says Henry's not coming back, buddy. I, that's uh, I'm I'm pretty sure we've uh, I think we've made that clear. I think we've made that clear, buddy. <laughs> he said uh, random guy says yeah. Well, uh, thanks for we know uh, thanks for stating the obvious. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy to me. Some people are really weird, bro. Some people are really weird, bro. Uh, CJ says uh, if we get a solid playmaker at wide receiver, I'll sleep better. It it's getting there. It's getting there, you guys. Don't worry about that. We'll be all right. We got five more minutes, fellas. Five more minutes. I'm Titan Anderson. Remember, y'all, y'all can't spell Titans without putting that T A in it. Get those questions in, fellas. Get them in, get them in, get them in, get them in. I love it, bro. Max is best Titan streamer. I hope so, bro. I mean, you know what I'm saying? We're putting in that work. We ain't playing around. We ain't playing around, y'all. Hey, Thursday, you guys. Thursday, we're gonna have to figure out. Um, I'm off Thursday. But uh, we're going to have to do something different uh, Thursday. We're going to have to do something different. So join the Discord so we can keep you guys up with that. Uh, Thursday, we're going to have uh, uh, my six-year wedding anniversary. So uh, me and wife, you're going to go out and have a, a nice dinner and go shopping and just have have, have, have fun enjoying each other's company. Uh, so we're going to put out a, uh, a live stream earlier in the day, fellas. Uh, m- maybe two. Uh, we'll see. But um, we're going to have a, we're going to have an earlier show that day. Uh, but But again, everybody that's subscribed will know everybody everybody will know uh ariel carter says remember a lot of us doubted Rand picking up levis and ty j i believe he bring the best fit players for this team that's what i'm saying bro a lot of people need to realize that Rand carthon knows what he's doing bro just trust in Rand. trust he's gonna get it done bro i think Rand's gonna i think Rand's gonna continue to bring in the right guys to continue to make this thing this team go forward let's go man the goal was to get as close as close to 13 550 we're not there yet you guys but if everybody hits that subscribe button really quick let's get a pause for this pause for the cause check real quick everybody back out hit that subscribe button join us for all future live streams nfl football tennessee titans baby i love it just says let's go ravens baby hey there you go cm says who's your top five nfl teams if you're saying top five like uh like who's the best or, or, or who's the top five that I like? Because I don't like any teams other than the Titans. Who's the best? One is the Titans. Uh, I think um, who's a really good football team? Uh, Chiefs, obviously. Fucking cheaters. Um, <laughs> 49ers. Um, uh, hmm. I'm trying to think of... Uh, uh, Ravens, obviously. Especially with Derrick Henry. Fuck. Um, I mean, the bills are really good in the, in the regular season, but in the playoffs, Josh Allen just likes to run and fumble. So I'm not going to pick them. Let's see. Let me choose one more for you guys. Let me choose one more. Uh, I would choose the lions, but they ain't got to, I, I just don't trust Jared goof. Um, what do we got? You know, green Bay, green Bay sneaking up low key, man. Green Bay's putting together a beast, man. I, I see what they're doing there. Jordan love took big steps, but I'm not going to put him in this, 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 this talk right now, but. Uh, they've been really good as well. Um, what do we got? Man, I hate to, I don't even want to mention the Texans because they, they're a really good ass football team too. They went out and brought in everybody in the free agency. It's crazy. Fucking Texans. I can't stand that team, bro. Uh, the Eagles are no longer available. Uh, the, the, you can't even put the Eagles in this conversation because they don't even have the same football team. So it's crazy. Uh, he says, You got my sub, though. You seem like a good dude. I appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you, bro. What's up, Alan Darby? How you doing, bro? Uh, CJ says, bro, what if we shock the world and draft uh, bro out of LSU at quarterback? What the? Why would we? What? CJ, bro, what the fuck? <laughs> why would we draft a quarterback when we have so many other things, bro? Oh, man. I hope you're just fucking with me, man. I really hope you fuck with me. CJ said Texans stealing everyone's facts. Oh, I'm telling you, bro. Everybody hit that link, bro. We're almost at 70 members. That's what, that's what's up, man. We're built. We and that's it's not even that new. It hasn't even been here for. This will be the start of the Discord season. So let's get it up there uh, as much as possible before the season starts, fellas. Uh, CM says. Uh, all right, I'm going to have to hop off. Thanks for hosting such a good stream, big dog. I appreciate you, man. Stay safe, buddy. All you new people, man, all you new people in the chat, let us know, man. Let us know if you're here and you guys are enjoying yourself. Uh, that, that's what matters most, that we all have a good time. 
uh, and make fun of the Jaguars every chance we get. Braden says, I'm a Bengals fan. Yeah, hey, man, thank you for our corner. Hopefully you guys can send us T. Higgins, make us a little friendly deal to where we both kind of can eat. You know what I'm saying? You know, send T. Higgins our way. We, you know, work with us a little bit. You know what I'm saying? We're going to give you a little something nice. You give, you know what I'm saying? Let's work. Let's make this happen. He's going into his fucking prime, bro. Come on, bro. Will Levis needs that big ass bodied fast ass receiver to throw to. He says, no, come on, bro. Let's work. Let's work on something. This is crazy. Uh, Avik says, apparently the Chiefs like the Titans offer, but they trying to drive up price. Hopefully they take the deal and we get them. Yeah, the Chiefs are a bunch of bullshitters. They just don't want us to take them because the Chiefs know the Titans always play the Chiefs tough. Um, Jeffrey Simmons and, and the Titans really hurt the Chiefs that one time when we beat them. Patrick Mahomes on the last play got really, really banged up. It looked like his back broke in half. It was nasty. Uh, Jeffrey Simmons and them boys really gave it to I don't even think they scored that game, right? Didn't They, they didn't score a touchdown, right? Uh, that was crazy. But um, again, let this Titans team get built. You already see the attitude. You already see the direction we're going. So I'm super excited, bro. Uh, over chicken saying it too. Sneed of the Titans rumors are getting reported. And you guys got to remember, he's fresh out. He's ready for that deal, bro. He's ready for that deal. He's going into his prime too, bro. Are you kidding me? That would be our three corners. Are you kidding me, bro? Titan Nation. Come on, bro. Think about those three corners. McCreary with his shorter arms can stay inside. Chidobe. And Sneed on the outside, bro. Come on, Teutonians. Come on, Teutonians. Oh, man. Hey, bro. Again, we're going to be live again tomorrow. Again, it sucks that we got to close this out because we got here late. We wanted to do a two-hour stream, but we went an hour and a half over already. And uh, I appreciate y'all so much. Again, eventually, we're going to have to do like three, four-hour streams and have guests on, man, because you guys are just, uh, it's crazy. And the, and, and the channel's growing so fast, man. So again, join the Discord. Join the family. Uh, subscribe, tell everybody, go get your little brother and your grandma's phones, go hit that subscribe button. Uh, we're at 13,520, you guys, that's amazing. We gained like almost 40 new subscribers from this live stream. Sorry that I, I again, like 11 hours at work or some shit like that, ridiculous, right? But again, I got kids and a wife and a family. This doesn't pay enough yet to be able to just go live for 10 hours a day, y'all, but th that shit's coming. And when that shit's coming, y'all ain't gonna wanna leave, bro. We're gonna have different segments, different parts of the days. We're gonna have battles. We're gonna, you guys don't even know what's coming over here. We haven't even talked about the battles yet. Oh my God. Oh my God. I love it, man. I appreciate y'all so much. Again, I'm Titan Anderson. I cover the Tennessee Titans, but I talk football. I love talking football. It's my passion. Talking NFL football, uh, even hearing other people's stories, why they're fans. It doesn't even have to be just be Titans fans. All fans here are welcome. Just ignore the fucking politics, ignore the race, and ignore the religion. We don't care about none of that here. Everybody's one. Over here, over here, all my subscribers, their skin is two-tone blue. You get what I'm saying? We're just different. You know what I'm saying? We are like descendants from the Anunnaki or something. I don't know. Maybe. But but my point is, it doesn't matter. Who gives a shit? We all family over here, man. We all two, from Teutonia. We Teutonians. This is what we do. We talk football. So even if you're not a Titans fan, welcome. Welcome. I appreciate you guys again. Make sure you guys hit that like, comment, subscribe on your on your guys' way out. If you guys are feeling generous, cash app, money sign, Titan Anderson. Send a message we'll put on the community page. Also, memberships. The brand new memberships are coming in less than three weeks, baby. Less than three weeks. All of the loyalty badges come back. All the custom emojis are back. The live streams don't end. We're going all the way up, baby. I hope all of you guys come with me. Again, I'm Titan Anderson. You can't spell Titans without putting that T-A in it. Derek Henry, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, bro. Tighten up Code Blue Cyclops swag. I love y'all. Let's go. Wow.